By now, it is no secret that I have become a Tribit fanboy. I just like their products, their speakers, and especially their headphones. I've recently crowned these Tribit X-Free Tunes as budget royalty, and they are by far my favorite headphones of 2019, but now they have a big brother called the Tribit Quiet Plus. Now I know, yeah, I'm a fanboy and all, but it's not because Tribit's paying me. I know some troll is gonna be in the comment talking about, oh, Tribit's just paying me. Dude, these headphones cost like 35 or 50 bucks or something like that. Do you really think this company is paying me to like their products? Yeah, they send everything over here for me to showcase on this channel, but so does every other company. But these, these, these are legit. Stop talking trash, try it for yourself. Now let's take a look at the Tribit Quiet Plus. Got trolled by the bag. Quiet Plus noise canceling headphones. This is their entry into the active noise cancellation segment of over ear headphones. And I am excited to try these. If they sound half as good as these uh, X Free Tunes right here, I'm gonna love them. Let's do it. All right, y'all know I don't like to rattle off specs. So uh, yeah, go to the link in the description and uh, you can read all the specs you want. While you're doing that, we'll be over here unboxing these headphones. Oh yeah, mm. <laughs> Oh, Trivet knows what I like, man. They know I like that new stuff smell. Hey, hashtag new stuff in the comments section if you're ready to get into the Trivet Quiet Plus. First off, you get a really nice case. I don't know if it's the same case as you get with the X-Free Tune. I forgot what it looks like, but uh, yeah, you do get a nice semi-hard shell case that's nice and like sturdy on the ridges here or on the edges, but it does have some flex in the middle. So yes, this will protect your headphones in the event that you are traveling. Let's open this up. Man, that new stuff smell is strong. Ooh, okay, so here we go. We got some instructions right here, which I may or may not need. Got a little pocket here to store your accessories. So they've upgraded to USB-C charging. Yes. And right here, you got your 3.5 millimeter aux cord, just in case you wanna to listen to them wired. Why would you do that? These are Bluetooth headphones. You guys with the wire, you kill me. Anyways, let's pull out the headphones. Man, yes, I like them. They don't swivel, but the cups do articulate, which is nice to have. That way you can get the proper fit on your head. On the outside of the ear cup, you got this slanted uh, Tribit logo right there, which is kind of nice that they've minimalized the branding right there. And then we slide up to the headband area and everything's pretty much seamless around the headband until you get on the inside and that's where you got this uh, vinyl right here which your plush headband so it won't hurt the top of your dome hopefully these feel very comfortable because this is a thick uh, headband right here now we come to the opposite ear cup and i can see a noise canceling mic right there on the outside and then this looks like noise canceling mics right here too or these could be the audio mics that you actually speak into as you're uh, taking your phone calls or whatever but I'm gonna trust that these are probably noise canceling mics. On the back of the right ear cup, you got a plus and minus rocker right here. And in the center of that rocker, you got your multifunction button, which also doubles as your power. Then you have a noise canceling switch. This is an on off switch. So you might wanna be careful not to leave these on noise canceling while you're not using them because it'll probably drain the battery. Uh, then you got your 3.5 millimeter port right there. And then there's your USB-C charging port. Right here, you got some soft ear cups, which almost feels like memory foam. It's like a really dense memory foam. It's not springing up incredibly slow, but it's slow enough to be almost considered memory foam. Now let's put them on my head just to see how they fit. Yeah, that's, oh, that's kind of nice. Let me expand the headband a little bit. All right. This is nice, not too much clamping force. They got some good passive noise canceling without even turning the ANC on. Now y'all know how I like to do. I like to test my headphones with the ANC off first just to see if they have a pretty decent sound profile. And then I test them out again with the ANC on just to see if it degrades the sound at all or even makes it better. So let's try these with the noise canceling off. All right, today we're gonna play some of this Blake Shelton doing what she likes. Hey, I know a lot of people out there don't like country music, man, but let me tell you something. You need to broaden your horizons. Cause if you don't like Blake Shelton, I don't know if we can be friends, man. And I don't really care what kind of woman you got. If you follow through with the lyrics of this song right here, bruh, it's gonna change your life. She likes hearing how good she looks in them blue jeans. Little kisses sweeter than sweet tea. Okay, all right, Tribbit, man, you did not let me down. The ANC is off and these sound great. Whew, okay. So first off, you do get plenty of bass. It's a nice balanced sound with these. They get plenty loud, so you could work out with these if you like loud music, but I don't know, man. I wouldn't, I mean, these are kind of nice. I know they're budget, but 
these are nice headphones, man. This is like your, your everyday kind of set right here. So I don't know if I would suggest working out on these, even though you could. But back to the sound, yes, they get loud enough for that. And they carry those nice bass notes. As far as the mids and highs, nice and clean and balanced with the bass. But it's really like the mids and highs are pushed a little forward and I feel like Blake was in my ears. Like he was in my ears singing that tune to me. And my favorite part of what I just listened to as far as that song is concerned, I could hear the instruments and it sounded very spatial. It, it wasn't like I could feel or sense where the instruments were coming from, but it didn't feel like the music was really being pushed into my ears. It felt like I was more of in an open room if that makes sense to you at all. Now here comes the ultimate test. Hopefully they don't destroy this wonderful sound profile I just heard with this noise cancellation. Sermons and politics, miracles come with each and every flip. That the narrow from zero, so heaven Oh man, that fat Joe is what's up. Hey, there is, I mean, dude, noise canceling on versus off there's almost no difference at all. You do get a slight sound shift, but it doesn't degrade any of the quality as far as the balance of the music. I, I think maybe you you might get a slight bit more bass, but it's not even really enough to notice, especially when you have them turned up. In freaking incredible. Oh man, I am very impressed with the performance with the noise canceling on and off. I enjoyed the sound when the noise canceling was off. And it's good to know that I can turn it on and I'm going to get the same experience. So Tribit, you definitely get a thumbs up from me on that regard. These already sounded great and I was praying that the ANC didn't ruin the sound. <sighs> How do they even do it at the prices that they're charging? I, I just don't get it, man. These sound right on point with some headphones that cost probably up to $200, $250, man. These are excellent. If you're looking for some noise canceling headphones, that block out, you know what? I gotta take these outside. I gotta see how they really perform with noise canceling before I bump them up there with the $200 price range uh, headphones because the sound is there. They got about $200 worth of sound pumping out of here as far as the quality and the balance and everything else. Now I gotta test this noise cancellation because it was actually pretty good. Let's take this outside. As you can see, I'm in a really noisy environment. Man, look over here. I got a tree service over here, cutting trees in the background. Then if you come over to this side, I got traffic over here and stuff. So yeah, I'm at a park. It's really loud here, but let me take these off. Wow, okay. Yeah, they do block out quite a bit of sound. Now it's not gonna cut everything down to like the absolute minimum like the Sony XM3s would, but we got about $200 worth of noise canceling out of these budget headphones. With the traffic and the tree cutting going on, it definitely muffled it down enough for me to listen to a YouTube video and enjoy some music at a lower volume, and it wasn't really disturbing me at all. So it kind of pushes all the noise you don't want to hear to the background and sets it to the side. That way you can just enjoy the content you're listening to. We already talked about the overall quality of the music. It's pretty insane, especially at this price point. I say these are definitely two thumbs up coming for me. Tribit has done it again, and I cannot believe they did noise canceling at this level at this price. No wonder why they're my favorites. That's why I'm a fanboy. Can't you tell now? I ain't no expert on this kind of stuff, but I do know a great set of ANC headphones when I hear them. And this is it. It's in my hand, man. Check it out. Look, if you had a good time checking out this video, make sure you wait a minute. I was about to throw up the emoji hands. Make sure you follow me on social media, man. I got like Instagram and Facebook and Twitter and all that good stuff. Follow me there while you're down there. Visit my other channels because they're down there too. Now you can throw up those emoji hands and I'll see you in the next one. Hey, where are you going? No, 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 no. Sit back down. We got to talk about this. You didn't have a good time? All right, then. Hit the subscribe button. There you go. Reach down there. There you go. And then hit the bell because you need to know when I'm opening up more new stuff. You got to come right back here and check this stuff out. Now, don't you feel like a better human being? All right. I knew you would. All right, man. I'll see you soon. Are you not entertained? Are you not entertained? Is this not why you are here?